It was a deadly double shooting overnight in Tempe. It led to an hours long police investigation. Yeah, police were there all night. Uh, Anita Roman joining us live this morning. Uh, they wrapped up the scene uh, just a little bit ago, Anita, but what happened here? What we're learning is that this uh, all stemmed from some type of domestic uh, violence confrontation. So the scene has been cleared. The car uh, where the victim and the suspect were in has been towed. Everything's back open to traffic. But let's go ahead and take a look at the video from the scene. First call came out around 8.15 last night. The understanding is that an 18-year-old woman shot to death inside that vehicle. Uh, there was some type of argument, um, some type of disturbance inside the vehicle. And then Tempe police told off camera that the 20 year old man who was driving the car exited the vehicle attempted to shoot himself has self-inflicted what they believe at this point are self-inflicted injuries he is expected to survive he is expected to be okay he was rushed to a local hospital the woman who was killed uh, was pronounced dead here on scene according to uh, Tempe PD there was a witness someone who saw that there may have been some type of altercation something happening within that vehicle potentially seeing the shooting and then saw the the, uh, the man uh, exiting the vehicle, and that is why police were called out here. So this was a very extensive investigation. Uh, they literally just opened up about an hour ago, so from 8.15 until about uh, maybe 6 o'clock in the morning is when police were out here. But uh, they're, they're being very clear that there's no threat to the community, that they do have their shooter. Uh, they do know who their shooter is. So as soon as that person released from the hospital, they'll be taken into custody. But again, the, uh, the shooter, the man in this uh, relationship has non-life threatening injuries 18 year old woman killed on scene shot multiple times back to you